We're going to learn how to checkmate a king with two rooks. Let's start by placing a white rook on a5, the other rook on b4, and a black king on h6. We're going to be using our rooks to run this king all the way to the back rank, ultimately deliver a checkmate. So in this position, the rook on a5 is cutting the king off, so the king cannot escape to the fifth rank. We will be using the other rook to check. So let's move the rook from b4 to b6. So now the king is in check and the king only has two available squares to go to. So the king will move to g7. And now our rooks change roles. So the rook on b6, which was checking the king just a move ago, is now cutting the king off. So now the king cannot move off to the 6th rank. And for the king not to get checkmated, it wants to go closer to the center and not to the edge of the board. So in this position, let's move the rook from a5 to a7. Now this rook is checking the king. Again, the king doesn't have too many options. The king is not able to move up to the 6th rank. So the available options are to move to the back rank. So let's move the king to f8. And finally, we're cutting the king off on the 7th rank. The king is stuck on the back rank and cannot move up. So now it's time to deliver a checkmate by moving our rook from b6 to b8. And that's how we deliver a checkmate with two rooks.